Well, this is the Calicats, the Calicats turn. This is a quickie review of The Mandalorian Season 3, Episode 1, The Apostate. So he jokingly immediately called the prostate. Because in the parody version, you see, he, he wants to be fisted. Exactly. Um, it's the only way to get back in their graces. Uh, yeah, I want you to fist me. <laughs> so yeah, um, no, that doesn't happen. Um, yeah, they, they, they wrote Karina's character out. It's been two years, uh, some, there was a review that I saw of it earlier, a critical drinker review, which he complained that, how could it be two years later, and he was training with him two years. Uh, it can be two years later, because we don't know when the Book of Boba Fett took place. So, yeah. So, uh, oh, was he training with him for two years? We don't know how long he was, we don't know how long Book of Boba Fett took place either. So that could have been over the, that period of years. And this could be literally year three of the two years, so it could work. Anyway, so we have we have Mandalorian going back to the planet to meet up with the Carta guy to get his uh, get his droid back, but his droid is broken. He's gonna get the droid. Back. Uh, but in the opening scene, they um, have him fighting um, the Mandalorian people. Are uh, you give a kid a helmet, and then there's like they fight a kaiju that's like a big kaiju alligator thing. And then, and then Mando shows him, saves them, and then, so you have to go to Mandalore and rescue the thing and refine this uh, crystal that he found, apparently. Brought the crystal back, and they said, oh, that's a crystal proof that Mandalore is not poisoned. I'm going to go back to Mandalore. And I keep thinking of this, of the David Weber series, the, the <laughs> this is unrelated, uh, the other Mandalorians in that. So. But those are Manticoreans, that is different. But it's close enough that he was probably thinking along the same lines. I thought of his series. Um, anyway, so uh, so they uh, yeah he goes to find a part. The robot tries to kill them, but they they turn him off, and they're gonna go find a memory core for the robot. That's basically it. Uh, around the way, to, then the pirates chase him, and then they escape the planet where they establish this fleet thing, and they kind of do the whole uh, they do the Resident Evil thing. They basically the fleet ladies on the planet. And she's all, oh, the fleet people left. They decided to do their own thing. They were mercenaries. Also, they wrote up Carino's character by saying, oh, she went to join some of their special forces, guy. Don't worry about it. <laughs> um, but, but, yeah. Disney ain't hiring her back. Ha-ha! Yeah, anyway, so, um, they didn't kill her off. They just said, oh, she's doing something else. Um, yeah, and it's supposed to be, the series is supposed to take place after Return of the Jedi, so it's, but before the sequels, so it's like there's like 30 years in there, like, taking place about five years after Return of the Jedi. Anyway, so uh, yeah, um, yeah, it was all right. I mean, yeah, it's simple enough story. Start out with uh, going after this quest sort of thing. Uh, it, it's already better than Book of Boba Fett, <laughs> which is something. Uh, which Book of Boba Fett suffered from being too long and drawn out. Same thing was wrong with uh, the um, the uh, the Kenobi series too. The Kenobi series should have been a movie, two and a half, three hour movie, and and Book of Boba Fett should have been too. Also a movie. Cut out all that extra shanies flashback stuff. Get a movie. Uh, instead, they dragged it on for seven or eight episodes or something. Um, they didn't have to because they ran out of ideas about halfway through. And, threw in Mandalorian stuff they didn't use for season two. Anyway, so that's my review of the quickie review of, of uh, the apostate Mandalorian um, premiere. Now, two years after the, uh, the last uh, season two. It is literally two years later, so yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so mm, didn't know we were coming back to this, but I guess as we are, there's enough people doing it. I had to go and do it too. So there you go. Oh, Mandalorian. Yeah, it was fine. <laughs>